In a world where two men, actually three men, made videos mostly about sneakers, they had to band together and rise above. I think I want to narrate my whole life like that from now on. It just sounds cool. Today we are going to go pick up a pair of sneakers, but every video needs an intro. So this is the intro. And in three, two, one, we're going to be in a car. We are back at the University Mall. I say back because if you are familiar with our sneaker excursions, our sneaker adventures, then you've seen us here before at a local spot, Kicks Are For Us. We've frequently frequented Kicks Are For Us and brought you along. So we are back now. We're gonna pick up the Air Jordan 3 Katrina and give you a little bit of an early look. It's a super clean sneaker. So we're gonna grab those and then we're gonna be headed back to the Bat Cave. In and out, super quick, easy transaction. Souts to kicks are for us for always looking out. We came to get the Air Jordan 3 Katrina, the Hall of Fame, whatever you want to call it. Those are inside this bag, but we also picked up another pair that's a little bit early, so uh, you can get a sneak peek of those as well. Right now, we are headed back to the Bat Cave, AKA the workshop, AKA where the magic happens. When you were born for this moment, you get the aux cord and you are ready. Vomit on a sweater already, mom spaghetti. Yes. Go deep. Bam. Here it is. Bang, bang. The Air Jordan 3 Katrina. They are also calling them the Hall of Fame. Uh, you know, call it whatever you want to call it. It is a very, very nice sneaker. Now, a little quick background. Actually, before the background. These release tomorrow, May 12th, and they are $190. This sneaker, it, it originally released in 2006 as a charity release to help some of the hurricane Katrina relief. So obviously a great cause when it comes to charity and when it, when it comes to helping people, that's always dope. Now, releasing years later, it's kind of like, I don't know, it's kind of, I know some people kind of feel a certain type of way about it because are any of the dollars that come from this sneaker now going to go towards charity? I really don't know. I don't know. They were super limited back in 2006 and anytime you have limited, it doesn't matter what it's for, what the cause is, or what it is, people are gonna want the sneaker. That's just supply and demand, that is just how it goes. All that aside, it is a dope sneaker. Quality on it is very, very nice. I'm gonna to toss this back to Senor Buckets because uh, B-roll is gonna make these look a lot better than I am. So those are the release details. It's a Jordan 3. They fit true to size, at least in my opinion. It's a, it's a Jordan Retro. They did a nice job with the quality. Mutabella, you know what I mean? So uh, that's pretty much, here, let me see it back, I guess. Um, so I'm not gonna talk too much about these. I just wanted to kind of bring you along with us as we pick them up and then kind of give you an early look as they do release tomorrow. White tumbled leather, elephant print, got the red on the heel, Red on the tongue, Jumpman, air on the back in black. You know, it's just a white and red Jordan 3 for the most part. The classic Jordan 3 bottom. That's all. Buckets. Anything to say from over yonder ways? No. There it is. So, 
Uh, I wish I had a cool outro like we started the video. Maybe I can just, in a world where the Jordan 3 was at the pinnacle of the mountain. Nah, that doesn't work. Here, just take it back. Thank you, sir. Thank you for watching. We appreciate you. I am Foamy. Buckets is behind the camera, and we are out of here.